Hey everybody, Aaron here, really quick. I just wanted to let you know that this video and the following video, the Marvel Crisis Protocol Battle Report, were filmed about a month ago before the stay-at-home orders in the state of Illinois. Josh and I are maintaining um, not only social distancing, but we are also staying at home uh, for the protection of ourselves and everybody else. So please enjoy these videos, um, and we hope that everybody is healthy and safe, and we will do battle reports once all of this is resolved. Gonna do this. Bye. Peoples of the internet, welcome to the Cool Guys Nation studio. We have another unboxing for you. We got two new mats from Table War, fat mats, both of which we are going to be using for mostly MCP. Marvel Crisis Protocol. Although, of course, you can also use them for 40K and Infinity and all sorts of things. We are buying 4x6 mats because for us, they give us the most amount of versatility across the most number of games, even though we do have to truncate them to 3x3 for Marvel. Um, but it also lets you pick kind of different sections. That's true. Which is sort of cool. So we're going to take a look at two mats. One is open. Open and is called Techno City, right? This is Techno City? Yeah, I think this Techno is Techno City. City. And the other one is Ship Interior. Ship Interior. Aaron's going to check the name. I am going to ask Aaron to bring me something to cut this box open with. Never do what he just did. <laughs> Not if you want your mats to survive. So fat mats are definitely my favorite mats. They are always very high quality. Every mat that we have had has lasted a really long time. Have we had one that's been blown out? <laughs> I'm just joking. The, they, don't, they don't really get blown out. No, I'm joking. I don't nothing know, happened. No, I don't they're just perfect. Means. They're perfectly functional. But what does blown out mean? I'm just saying, how do you wear out a mat? Oh, like the corners peel or... Okay. You know, yeah, we haven't had anything, any um, issues. They get torn or they get stained or something really easily. Uh, so I think we have six or seven Table War fat mats now. And I'm really excited for this one. All right, so this is how they come. Hold on. Oh. You pull it out. Super nice bag for you to hold it. The coolest thing. They come with a tag that you can put your name and your contact number and a picture of the map that's inside. So you can visually figure out which one it is right away. And of course, you can go to tablewar.com in order to get your mats. Not a sponsor, although Doug is a cool guy. If you want to be a sponsor, <laughs> I'm happy to take your sponsorship. Wow, this one's bloody. Yeah. All right, you gotta grab it. Can you see any of this action that we're doing? I think so. All right. Wow, that one's really vibrant. Yeah, this is cool. Guess what? Chicken butt. Well, backwards again. Now, it's it's that way so you can see what man it is instantly in the roll. Correct. But it makes it less cool to unbox. Whoa. Oh, this is cool. This one's awesome. All right, this is like straight up uh, Event Horizon ship right here, dude. All you got, all you cool people know that Event Horizon's a Warhammer 40k movie. Yes, that is true. And this looks like a Warhammer 40k ship. Big old bloody spot in the middle. Got a bunch of saw blades and trash walkways. Yeah, we need different. I don't know if the the city train that we have for Marvel would work well. This will this definitely one. not work with that one, but it's super fun. But you know what we can use with it? All of the uh, GW pipes and yeah, bridges. Yeah, for sure. And we get, it'll definitely be the interior of the city. We could use bulkheads, stuff oh, like yeah. that. So this is super cool. This would be like a uh, possessed hell carrier or something. Yeah, that one's really fun. So those are our two new mats. Did you show some good detail on this one? I did. I like this one. We are going to be playing on the High Tech City mat tonight. We'll be setting up a board here in a moment for a game of Marvel Crisis Protocol. And in that game, we got some new characters. We do. Let's roll this one, actually. Let's roll, roll it. it. Let's roll it. Up. Roll it. Roll it. Roll it. Uh, who are you playing with tonight? Uh, I am going to play with uh, the Asgardians, I think. 
Nice. Because I want to try those out. Are you going to do Wakandans? Well, I mean, we're going to make our roster, so we might not play any of that. So, depending on what it, what it did. Um, I'm feeling, I kind of want to play Spawn. I'm feeling like... I'm feeling, Spawn? I feel like Sp what's Spawn. Why do I always do that? What is Spawn? Venom. It's, no, it's Spawn, dude. I'm, I'm sure that Venom had a lot to do with Spawn's creation. Honestly. I always if you think about I it. I always conflate the two. Well, you're not far off, honestly. One of them has got a symbiote. Oh, so they both do. Yeah. They both do. <laughs> First thing we picked up is some awesome 3D printed objectives for all the different objectives in the game. Most of them are painted, which is great. Yeah, we've got the consoles, we got the cubes, we got the spider infected, the serum, the files, whatever this is, the Wakandan herbs, the scrolls, and the gamma. What did I just Gamma say? shelters. Gamma shelters. So they're not quite the perfect size for this, the token, but. For us playing on the channel, it's cool enough for us to, to go with. We really think this is, they look awesome. On top of the objective markers, we also picked up some new terrain. We have this train and the train tracks, taco truck, bunch of cars. We have some custom uh, augmented buildings. So we got the daily grind and then another daily bugle. We also have the sweet Jack Link's truck who's at the Pepsi company. And what's that? Why is there a Coke machine at the Pepsi company? I don't know. New police cars, porta potties, all sorts of stuff. There's a lot more than this. Um, we probably have enough to make three or four new boards, but you're just gonna have to wait and see the rest of it. We're gonna go ahead and film a game right now.